Setting up the vehicle area requires a sled constructed of a rigid material that allows maximum kinetic energy to transfer into the test barrier, with resistance-free wheels that can fit onto the ramp tracks. Sled wheels are designed to support the maximum applicable weight and not suffer any obstruction during the roll downwards to replicate the moving industrial vehicle. The ramp must also be a solid structure with an inclined plane at a predefined angle, with parallel tracks or rails integrated onto the ramp to guide the sled. A winch to pull the sled up to the required height to generate the energy desired for a particular test. A speed trap constructed of two mats or two lasers is used to measure the velocity of the vehicle when it impacts the barrier. The sled must be weighed on a commercially certified scale in order to determine its mass. The bumper striker or two fork striker chosen for the test must be secured to the sled in a manner that makes it integral. Any weights added or removed from the sled to adjust its mass must be weighed on a commercially certified scale and bolted on. The test barrier must be positioned so that the sled striker will impact at the desired location on the barrier.